It's the Strauss Project, and we're, we're in, in Nashville. Nashville. Rock on, Micah! Strauss Project rolls on in Nashville. I'm with Devin Micah of Micah. Hey, thanks for hanging out with us. Of course, thank you. Here we are in Nashville, and you've got to be pumped to play for the crowd here. Oh my gosh, it's just been amazing. The social media has been going off the wall, so I'm super excited. It's Music City, as they call it, Nashville, so there should be a great turnout tonight. We're really looking forward to your set. Oh, well, thank you. You know, it, it's it's been great just talking to everyone, all everybody that's on the bill, the host, Bobby, Luke, and Athena. It's just, it's going to be awesome. And you and the band and have a new EP out as well. Yes, it's called Diamond in the Rough. It came out May 27th, and you can purchase it on Amazon, iTunes, stream it on Spotify. Uh, we also have it at all of our shows for $5. So you can support Micah while they're on the road, and talk a little bit about the road trip that you guys are on right now. Oh, it's been crazy. You know, we're coming from Los Angeles. We just packed into a Prius, and we just drove to Nashville. It's been awesome. How long of a ride is that? I looked at the GPS today uh, for when we go back home. And uh, it's it's a day and four hour drive. Wow, and five dollar CDs, folks. And then after you go home from this great event, after this weekend is over, you're gonna go back to Los Angeles for a couple days, and then you're going where? We are going to be going to New Hampshire for Laconia Fest, June fifteenth with Steven Tyler. Playing with Steven Tyler has got to be incredible uh, for you as a musician. Who else would you like to play with? I'm actually crossing off a lot of bucket list artists. Uh, we're opening up for Buck Cherry this year uh, at the Rainbow. Uh, gosh, but one that is not even close to us playing, but I want to play with uh, would Aerosmith, Kiss, Bon Jovi for sure. Bon Jovi has definitely influenced me and Micah. We actually covered one of his songs, Last Cigarette, on our EP. So definitely Bon Jovi. Okay, we're in Nashville. Do you have any country influences? Oh, yes. Oh, well, I'm originally from Texas. I love Keith Urban, Taylor Swift. She's always been like one that I have watched. Um, we, we both uh, are under the same publishing company, and we are both in the top five youngest publishers wow. to publish songs. And Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson, I think, is the youngest. So uh, she's always been like, I've always been watching her like, oh, I got to beat T-Swizzle, but you know, she's beating me right now. So. Yeah, she's beating everybody. And she's beating everyone right in the world right now. So. Don't worry. Hopefully <laughs> one day you get to that level. Well, you know, I'm hoping. As an up-and-coming musician, you have a lot of influence on younger people that are looking up to you. So yes. what advice would you give them if they were just starting? Whatever you are interested in doing, do that to your fullest potential. You know, if you want to be a vet, do that. You know, go to school, stay in school, go get your degree and go do what you want to do. Yeah, you're in school right now. You said you had homework last night. I am. Last night was my last day of school, so I'm ready to party for this weekend. All my teachers know I'm here and they're like, oh, good luck in Nashville. And I'm like, great, don't fail me. <laughs> so you can make it work even at a younger age, even if you're just starting out, don't think that you can't do it. Look at Devin Micah. Yeah, you know, there's so many alternatives, you know, with schooling. I do school online, so there's always a way. There's always a way. Just don't give up. Excellent. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out with us in Nashville. Thank you for having me. Do that high school musical jump. Yes. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> 